Hi, I'm Brandi Webster with the G-STEP program here at UNT, the Graduate Student Teaching Excellence Program. And what that program does is it um, engages students who desire to teach, whether as a TA, um, a TF, or a, eventually as a professor, it gives them the tools they need to be able to teach in an adult education environment. I am also a College of Information Learning Technologies a Department a Master's student. My degree is in Workforce Learning and Performance, and I'm about halfway through that program. And I've actually taken Dr. Pasquini two other times, and I'm actually taking her currently as a master's student as well. So I just want to thank Dr. Pasquini for giving me this opportunity to um, do my teaching practicum within her course. Um, I am thankful for that opportunity, and I'm really look forward to um, not only sharing some of my knowledge that I have gained, but I also am looking forward to the feedback you have to offer so that I can learn and grow myself. For this assignment, you'll begin with some reading resources. First, you'll take a look at soft skills. And in this article, it's just a list of 87 soft skills that you can consider whether they're your weaknesses or whether your strengths. If you're not sure what your strengths and weaknesses are, I highly recommend you take this quiz, to, it's a personality type quiz, and it will help you to see your strengths and some of your weaknesses. Next is a resource on how to um, answer that question, what is your greatest weakness? Next, you'll want to consider what questions to ask your employers. And this article is a great one on addressing that. I've also added, added some additional reading resources on here for you. And finally, let's discuss the assignment details. So for this assignment, you're going to create a mock interview video where you will select three non-industry specific interview questions for your mock interview. You're gonna develop the answer to each of your questions, which should be approximately 200 words in length or two to three minutes long. You're gonna record this mock interview. And in this recording, make sure that you show yourself from the waist up. Make sure you're dressed professionally and that that's visible on camera. Pay attention to your style and presentation, including gestures, facial expressions, voice tone, and just expressions. Next, consider the lighting, the background, and the film sound and quality. Once you have recorded your video, you're going to upload your mock interview video to YouTube. Remember, accounts are free. And right here is a great link on how to upload a video to YouTube. So after the interview, I want you to write a reflection paper on your experience and answer the following questions, approximately 150 to 200 words per answer. How you felt about the mock interview. Um, did you effectively answer the questions and maintain a professional composure throughout and speak with authority? How did you address soft skills? How did you share both strengths and weaknesses in your interview? And after reviewing the video, what did you find that you would like to do differently? And did you feel doing this mock interview helped prepare you for future interviews? And then explain why or why not. So you're going to submit a Word document. It's going to have the URL um, website to the video at the top. And then you're going to write your reflection paper um, answering these questions. The final thing you'll need to do for this assignment is complete this feedback survey. Just follow this link. It'll take you to a very quick, short survey. and It'll allow me to reflect on how I've done based on your feedback um, so that I can learn and grow. Here is a list of references for the um, required articles, including the personality type, which is not required but highly recommended. Thank y'all, and I look forward to seeing your mock interviews. I just want to thank you all again for participating. I want to thank, uh, again, Dr. Pasquini for allowing me this opportunity, and I look forward to seeing all of your work. Thank you.